All right, what's up, guys? I want to talk about in this video. I'm gonna, let's talk about like um addictions, right? With addictions, they're a very tricky thing. You know, we we've, we've all heard about like people with drug addictions, people with uh, addicted to fapping, masturbating, beating their meat, people addicted to all these different bad things. And really, the nature of how addictions work is that you have a first experience, right? You have that experience that initially is a really good one. It's a good experience. So for example, you smoke for the first time, you get high for the first time, or you um, you eat that, get that first lick of chocolate, you know? Get that, fur, you beat your meat for the first time. Like. <laughs> To make it funny, um, you beat your meat for the first time. You, all these things for the first time, right? First time you got the experience, it's great. It's absolutely, you love it. You love it. It's a completely like 10 out of 10 bomb experience. And what happens? Well, you look for that experience. You look for that same amount of stimulation, dopamine and dopamine that you got from that first experience. You're looking for that again. That is what an addiction is. You know what I mean? Subconsciously, you are looking for the same amount and level of stimulation that you got from the first time that you did something. And so this is how tolerance builds up. So how alcoholics, instead of only taking one shot after a couple, after time goes on, they, they drink more. People, they smoke more. Why? Because that same amount of weed that they did and smoked before and got that level of stimulation for a couple years ago, that during their first um, experience, it doesn't do it for them anymore. This is why people who are people who are addicted to masturbation, they end up looking at really messed up websites. They look at the, they look for the really dirty stuff. And the reason why is because, again, that first video doesn't do it for them. Like, you could go and ask anybody who's addicted to that stuff. Did they, do they watch the same video that they seen the first time on the hub? No. They watch, like, millions of videos. They look for videos for, like, the perfect angle. Um, same thing with people who eat candy, kids who eat candy. You know, they get, like, some kids, some kids even, too, eat candy when they're, like, so young. You get me? But over time, you crave more and more of it. And so this is the part that is dangerous about addictions is that tolerance builds up. And again, I have to re I have to stress it so much. It's really the fact it's really that subconsciously you're looking to relive that first experience again. That is really what it all comes down to. You want to have an experience like that again because of how great it was, because it was so nice. Your dopamine was going crazy. You are very heavily stimulated. This is how addictive, addiction and addictive people work. This is how they think, you know. So I don't really have a solution at the moment. But this is sort of like, I won't say food. I don't know if it would make sense for me to say food for a thought. But like, if you are going through any addictions right now, if you're addicted to anything right now, addicted, if you have bad habits especially, this might be something that you need to like really think through and consider. Maybe you're just re maybe you're just subconsciously you're just searching to relive that first experience that you had with whatever it is you're having trouble giving up. So yeah. Like and subscribe. You give me <laughs> like and subscribe.